Hi, and welcome back. This is going to be a very interesting lesson, so please pay attention. We will discuss the potential impact of blockchain technology in the retail industry. But first, we'll discuss a term that has been previously mentioned in the course, the Internet of Things. IoT, which is how the Internet of Things is frequently referred to, is a concept that describes the interconnectivity through the Internet of different devices we use in our daily lives. We don't simply access the Internet from a computer anymore. There are different smart devices surrounding us that have built-in Internet-based functionalities and are connected to other devices or the cloud. We all know what smart TVs and smart phones are. Nowadays, many appliances are being produced with smart functionalities. Air conditioners that are connected with smartphones and track people's location to turn themselves on when you come home from work. Security systems connected to the Internet, notifying you if suspicious activity is registered at your home, and many others. Wearable devices are at the heart of the most recent discussions of the Internet of Things and the retail industry, and one of the first implementations of such wearable devices is security and identification. And this, without a doubt, means that blockchain technology can play an important role in this field. Many people wear badges at work and these provide security, identification, and in some cases valuable insights related to location, which can be extremely helpful for security reasons. It isn't an intuitive idea, but the badge itself is some sort of a smart device, playing a role in the Internet of Things. The chip it contains provides information about its holder, about his or her position, and any type of relevant data that has been stored in the system. Modern badges are even more secure, they require holders to use biometric identification such as fingerprint or eye scan. How is this related to the retail industry? Well, this goes on to show you that a simple chip inserted in a product can contain vast amounts of information. And if the information contained in this chip is recorded on the blockchain, it becomes immutable and unforgeable. In the same way, such chips can be added to most retail products. It is likely that many clothes, footwear, bags, perfumes, sunglasses, cosmetics, luxury goods, medicines, and so on will benefit from a transparent authenticity verification platform that will have scale and will be mass adopted. This would allow customers to scan footwear through a barcode or a chip inserted inside and receive valuable information about the product. They could be interested in learning the item's true producer, the country of origin, the source of materials and labor used, when the item was produced, and possibly the producer's recommended price. This could help remedy unethical practices like sweatshops and child labor in some developing countries. Moreover, famous brands like Nike suffer from a lot of counterfeit products. And the problem is that customers are not always able to distinguish Nike's original products from imitations. A blockchain-based verification process could help this issue. Nowadays, consumers have become very conscious about their health, the social impact of their actions, and they prefer products that have been produced the right way. In this context, the perspective of blockchain-powered verification and proof of authenticity becomes extremely useful. Consumers will be able to confirm the authenticity of the products they purchase. Gradually, unethical manufacturing practices and the market for counterfeit goods will shrink significantly. This is even more critical for cosmetics, medicines, and other healthcare products because quality of production and adherence to standards are not only desired but vital. A public blockchain-based registry could assure people that the medicines they buy have been produced by legitimate companies with solid reputations under the right conditions and standards and using appropriate ingredients. With such transparency, producers stand behind their products with their reputation and license to operate. They can be held accountable for bringing a faulty product to the market or breaking the rules otherwise. Such a registry would allow consumers to verify the entire life cycle of the products they buy. From a social standpoint, it would be possible to show consumers that the clothes that they wear have been produced in an adequate environment and certified by organizations verifying the decency of workplace conditions. And this is really important for a large part of the consumer population in our day and age. They want to know more about the life cycle of the products they use and are interested in. 
Quite importantly, when buying fashion products or cosmetics, customers want to know when an item has been produced. They don't want to be sold goods that have been produced a year ago. So such a type of certification would be useful from this perspective as well. All right, excellent. In our next lesson, we will talk about the impact of blockchain on media downloads such as music or films, software installations, and other products that have to do with intellectual property. This will do for now. Thanks for watching.